matter. We'll get into it a little bit more, but it's always great to start out with the pictures, isn't it? Okay, we're in our new area, and so like I said, we are going to open up our... Look like we're going to talk. Are we going straight into a battle? Oh my goodness, we are! Snowball fight! Wow! Okay, that's exciting. So this is going to be a little bit longer, so hold on to your seats. I didn't think we would be walking into a battle here. You're just sometimes never safe in Prodigy, are you? Okay, so this is going to have... This um, uh, will have the same amount of vertices. So this is one, two, three, and four. So four vertices right here. How exciting, huh? I love it when that happens. You think that you're all done and you think you're safe, but man, sometimes those monsters just jump out. A lot of good damage and a critical hit on our lead squally. On our lead squally. And it missed. Whew. Good, good, good. We might make it through this. We don't have a lot of mana, so this battle might be a little tough. What is the name of this shape? I know that triangle has three sides, so that's not it. I know that a square has four sides, so that's not it. I know it's a circle. A circle has zero sides. Okay. There we go. Let's see what Squally does. Got some really good points of damage on him, didn't we? 371 points? Hmm, this might be a tough one. Next round, we should be able to use our Star Cluster and hit everyone. We, we're going to have to focus on Light Wave this time, though. What is the name of this shape? So, a square has four sides that are equal, so all of the lengths are the same. And it has corners that are right, which means they're 90 degrees, so um, they look like a book or a block. Um, a rectangle has uh, two can have sides that are different, uh, two different lengths, but the ones that are across from each other have to be the same length, and they have uh, 90 degree corners. A circle is what we saw last time, and is a uh, perfect, <laughs> perfectly round shape. Um, and so we're going to go with rectangle here because this side is longer, this side is shorter. Okay? These sides. Let's cast. All right, all right, all right. And one squally down, two squallies to go. I think we should be able to use our AOE now. Winter's Breath. Ooh, he hits all of us. Let's go ahead and get him. But it was weak against Ice Sneak because Ice Sneak is also a winter ice themed character. How many sides does this shape have? Let's go ahead and count them. I'm going to draw to make sure that I don't go a little further and end up with a different number. One, two, three, four. Four sides. Cast our spell. Yes. Great work, great work, guys. Okay, 515 for both of them. We might be two attacks away. I'm loving this geometry with these shapes. I wasn't thinking we were going to get into it. So 375 points. Let's hit with our light wave. How many vertices does this shape? Remember, that are the, that is the corners of the shape. So let's go ahead and quickly count our corners. We have one, we have two, we have three, and we have four. Okay, four vertices in this shape. We will cast our spell. Yes, way to go. Oh, and 50 points. Man, I thought we were gonna get you. This is gonna get interesting. Here comes Icicle Shark, and it missed. Okay, whew starting to sweat over here it is getting close go to our light wave which shape is a square this is a right triangle you can see how it has this to show let us know it's a 90 degree angle like a little square inside um this is a circle our square is over here all of the sides are the same and all of our corners are right angles yes Okay, so one squally left. 
I don't know if I'm gonna have to switch monsters or not. We will have to see. We were not prepared for this at all, was were we? Okay, here's Freezy. And Freezy misses. Well, we only have one, so we're gonna use our light wave, which is a quadrilateral. Now, a quadrilateral, you may not know, um, but that is a shape that has four sides. And so I'm gonna click our um, light bulb just because you might not know what a quadrilateral is. So let's see how it explains it to us, okay? A quadrilateral has four sides. A quadrilateral has four sides. So we're gonna count the sides of these shapes to figure out which one is a quadrilateral. So this one has one, two, three, four, five, six. This one has one, two, three. This one has one, two, three, four. And so there is our quadrilateral, which is A. Let's cast our spell. Yes! Way to go, way to go. And 49 points left. Oh my goodness. What a tough freezy. Another ice shickle shard is coming and it missed. I really feel like we lucked out in this battle. I don't know if you guys do too or not. Okay, light wave is coming. It says, select the partition being shown in the picture. Halves, thirds, or fourths. So halves means that things are split into two groups. Thirds means that it's split into three areas. Fourths means that it is split into four different areas, four different groups. And for halves to be right, it has to be exactly half where both sides are the same. For it to be thirds, it has to be three where each of the three areas are the same size. Fourths, each area would be the same size. So let's go ahead and count just to make sure we have fourths. This is one, this is two, this is three, and this is four. So these are our fourths. If we had halves, it would be a circle with a line right straight down it. So there are two sides that would be the same if I had just drawn a circle. And then if it was thirds, the circle, that's looking better, that's looking better and close, okay, would be split into three areas where each of these were exactly the same. So we definitely have fourths here with our line. Let's cast our spell. We got it correct, way to go. Thank you for helping me with this and for coming. What a surprise, I had no idea we were gonna be attacked by three ghost monsters. Okay, we got 32 battle stars each. I think everybody leveled up, is that right? Connor gained 104 hearts. Apple Pot gained 80 hearts. And Ice Sneak. So everybody leveled up. Crazy. Gained 100 hearts. Awesome. We'll open up our chest. And it's still coming. It's still coming. My goodness. So we got 300 gold coins, one copper coin, and a morph marble for Brawl. Okay, let's click next. This is awesome, and as promised, we our miner is over here. We'll help. Oh, thank goodness she came before the monster returned. Wait, those weren't the monsters? Hmm, if those weren't the monsters, I'm a little bit. Woo, let's find out. Oh, goodness, no. I speak of the ice demon lurking in the mountains. Scary stuff it is. Mm, hope you're feeling brave for next time. I was trying to escape with the other miners. Bagging traps here. Hmm. Well, you wouldn't happen to know where we could find some power crystals, would you? Power crystals, eh? Well, there might be one or two left in the mines. If you don't mind, there is another task you can help me with. A few frozen blocks of ice should appear every day. Explore the mountains to find them. Once you have them, take them to any lit furnace to thaw them out. If you happen to find any ice crystals, bring them to me for rewards. Ooh, that sounds nice. 
Okay, all so... finished. Let's head back, okay? Okay, well, quickly head back, and then we're going to open up the ice crystal, or the um, conjure cube. So excited. We completed the job, too. I wasn't expecting for us to complete the job. <laughs> Buck knew you could do it. We knew we could do it, too. Or hopefully you guys did. With your help, I knew we could. Wow, a new hat. Would you like to put it on? Sure, let's go ahead and put on the Climber's Toque. Okay. All miners say is that power crystal in mines? Bark already know that. Head into mines and find that crystal. We've got our next quest. Okay, Conjure Cube, here we come. Let's share that with our buddies. Okay, fingers Thanks. crossed. Let's see what's going on. What are we going to get? Let's see. Got a rogue's hat, storm resist, and a firework. Awesome. Hmm. Maybe we will put on the rogue's hat. Two hats in like 23 seconds. That is awesome. And we'll share that, too, so all of our buddies know what's going on with us. Cool. So, thank you so much for coming. I think I will split this into two videos, because um, that surprise attack was, ooh, that was quite exciting. Um, and uh, I will be looking forward to seeing you guys next time. Okay? Have a great day, and thank you for coming and helping me math and mathing away a little bit of time with me. Take care, guys. See you next time. Bye-bye.